test latency. Test means is actually you know when you reboot a device, gives you actually in 3D. If you're just going to click and reboot, I'm just quickly showing you here, and they have some bug fixes. So guys, what you saw here is the way how you can play the YouTube uh, videos in the background. Not with the official YouTube app, but yeah, there's a workaround. So guys, this is an update video. I've shown you a uh, long back, I guess on August 8, 2016, if I'm correct. So the way you can play in the background. That was the hack of the non booted devices using Mozilla Firefox. I'm not really sure what may be the reason, whether it is an app update for the Firefox or with this app, whether it is an OS update, so whether Google really don't want you to play in the background or whether apps don't want to read in the background. So whatsoever it is, there's a new way you can play the YouTube again on the background. So this method is going to work on all of the Android devices. You don't need any root, you don't need any kind of super cool stuff. So as you can see, this is my desktop here and I'm just playing here YouTube and from the notification shape. You can just simply click here and right here you can see some information here it shows Chrome and then it shows HTTPS www.youtube.com video topic and the channel link and it's a play pause forward button. Okay guys, so let's get started and see. So I'm just going to show you demo on my Google Pixel XL. So all you need uh, is a Google Chrome browser. So open your browser and here you just uh, open a new tab and just go ahead and type youtube.com so once you have it open i'm just going to search my channel name here you can just play any video whatever you want so here's my channel name i'm just going to play the same video that i tried to show you there so first off just click and play the video and once you see this playing just pause it you can see it from here, you can see a notification. So all you need to do is click on the pause. So make, and also one thing you should notice here, there is a no a forward and the backward button. Only there is a play and the pause button, right? So once you pause it, just switch here to some another tab and start playing. You can see the notifications has gone. So what is the reason? I'm just going to tell you again. So you have to make sure you should use the desktop version. You can see right here, request desktop site. So as of now, it was m.youtube.com. Now it is only youtube.com. Now just click here and start playing. So it started playing here when you check out the request desktop site. Now you can see this again the same notification. Now what we are seeing, uh, there's a pause and play. When you pause it, can feel can play. Then there's a forward, then there's a backward. Now simply click pause from here and just switch to another tab. Now you can see the same notification is still there. You just click on the play. You start playing. You can minimize it. It's going to work as usual. You can work on any other application, whatever you want. It's keep on playing in the background. You can see it's perfectly working. Now, even if you lock your phone screen, you're going to see the same stuff here. You can start. It's going to work from all the places. So, guys, this is tip and some of the important points that you should notice here. First, go to the setting here and make sure uh, this is this should be request desktop website otherwise you will not able to play it as you can see right here I'm just working on a desktop website and go inside the setting and you have to make sure inside the site setting and uh, go to the notification you should turn that on this notification should be turned on otherwise it's not going to show you this notification which you have to use it and in case you have the Android NuGet make sure to go inside this apps and uh, the settings apps and go inside the Chrome and check out the notification make sure it should be setting the default I'm just telling you in case you have Android O otherwise it's not needed sorry this Android Nougat and in case you have Android O so this background playing is still not working I've tried to play it on my Nexus 6B it is not working so you can play in the background but once you lock your screen it's not going to work so maybe I guess it is uh, OS dependent Google really don't want you to play YouTube in the background so as of now this is the only Google Chrome's native app that is supporting other browsers for example Mozilla which was working previously it was not working so there you have it guys a cool way how you can play YouTube in the background as you can see here so guys thank you so much for watching I'll talk to you next video have a great day